guys, welcome back. Uh, it's a little bit too windy to spray at the moment, so what I'm going to do is make a PV or a can't roll, I think it's called, uh, which basically is a log roller. So when you are wood cutting and you cut all the way down, except for the last little bit, and you need to access the bottom, the PV helps you turn the log, it rolls the log. It just consists of a long pole with a pivot point and a hook and um, that, that's all it consists of and the hook hooks into the log and the lever gives you the leverage you need to turn or access the bottom part. So here we go. Uh, so what we're going to do here is a little bit of uh, butane heating and steel bending to make our hook. Just quickly go and quench it. Now we've got the nice hook piece. Nice and strong, can't be bent back. Put the hook piece, we're just gonna heat up and bash out this piece here. So basically like a forge. And um, then we've got a spot we can we can actually drill the, the hook to. Uh, I normally use a railway sleeper for an anvil when I'm um, forging anything, heating, heating up something and beating it out flat. I haven't got one so I'm going to have to improvise. So I know there's an old slasher blade out the back, that would be the ideal hard surface to pound away on and I've got a hammer that I can use to forge, which is fine. Alright, watch. Here we go. Flat the screw teeth. Now for taking the hook. Yeah, so let's see uh, the hook we done, more or less. Delicious. 
Done. Good through both plates. Now all I need to do is weld them up onto the main pole. the PV hook straight under here it's got plenty of play on it but uh, I'll just strengthen it up with some more weld on the inside here up and down here and then uh, and then we'll give it a demo parts, bolt goes through, hook faces the inside, goes through the next hole and then does up over here. Very simple design but works really really well. We're going to use this to demonstrate that when you're cutting and you cut halfway through you need to roll a big log to keep your hooks on like so and then you can roll. And you've got maximum leverage from the pole. Do a rear of a kick, hook it on, and you can roll the log. Simple as that. Same when you go in the opposite direction. Lock it, roll it, roll it. Works great with massive logs as well. Plenty of leverage. And uh, that's a PB. Thanks for watching guys, please remember to hit that like and subscribe, it really helps me out and I really appreciate it also. I uh, hope you enjoyed this one day build, bit of a change from the viticulture stuff, but there's only so much you can do, especially this time of year. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys on the next video.